going to start in a few minutes, and just want to remind everybody ahead of time, the superintendent is arriving. We're not going to have a lot of time with him, but we have his deputy here as well tonight. As Joe said, Alderman Moreno said, when we first heard about this, we were living. Literally, you know, my words, Joe's words, and the process that took place. And, and we want to see that change, not only in terms of what happened here at the 13th, but the way this city operates. Because this city has been operating in the wrong way for too long. And that's what we've been fighting to change. We need your help to change it. Now, we sat down, we sat down last week as well with Dan and many of the community residents. We talked about more than just the closing. We talked about politics, the way things operate. And I think it was a lesson for all of us in the way that we communicate and the way we have to communicate in the future. So tonight, make sure you have good, strong questions for how they're going to make sure that we're protected in the 13th district and in the other places throughout the ward, the neighboring wards, and the north side, and make sure that we have the police presence we need. We know we're down officers. You can't hide that fact. It's been out there for too long, and you can't backtrack. You can't cover the tracks of the things that have happened in the past, and we need to change that as well. So this is about making sure that we budget for more police officers on our street, and we need you to join us in that fight. That's right. That's right. Ask the tough questions tonight, but be, be vigilant in the way that you look at the way we move this city forward in the future. Thank you very much. Everybody file in and let's get this thing started.